You have six seconds to like this video right now if you want to wake up tomorrow morning with a trillion dollars on your GTA account. What is going on YouTube, welcome back to a brand new video. Just before this video does go on to start, shout out to the amazing people on screen right now. If you would like a shout out in a future video, all you have to do is comment hashtag VenomPlays and make sure to comment that 2-3 times and hopefully you will get a shout out in a future video. Also be sure to check out my merch. My merch I'll leave it linked in the description down below as well in my about section on my YouTube, so definitely be sure to go check that out. Also, make sure to check out my community posts, so that way you stay up to date on all the latest stuff happening on the channel, whether it be giveaways, new videos, anything like that. Also make sure to hit the join button beside the subscribe, so that way you are always kept up to date with the channel and what's all happening with it, and you will also get exclusive giveaways exclusively to the members. So definitely be sure to go check out the join button. So yeah, let's get right into the video. What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, I am going to show you the director mode glitch and it still works. So like this glitch still works. You can get white joggers, any color joggers that you want as well as modded outfits. Now to do this, make your way to the nearest time trial. Time trials tend to change, so if you're watching this, time trial may be different for you or it could be in the exact same spot. From there, simply put on a simple standard outfit and then put on a parachute. If you don't have a parachute, simply go ahead and get a helicopter or register as a CEO to spawn a helicopter quicker. Once you're in the helicopter, it will actually give you a parachute. From there, what you want to do is put the parachute on and then set your location to last location. The reason you want to do the last location is so you don't spawn in your apartment as sometimes that does tend to mess it up when actually saving. So you just want to make sure you have your location set to last location. Once you have done that, simply get in the car and then start the time trial. When you go ahead and actually start the time trial, go to story mode by pulling up the wheel. When you actually do make it into story mode, go ahead and pull up the interaction menu and go to director mode. When you're in director mode, make sure you actually have a bird and your online character shortlisted. So you can literally do, I believe most birds bar the chicken as that does not work. So, you want to, so for me, I actually do use the chicken hawk. So then from there just go back and forth between the bird and your online character and you will in fact see the bird starts to duplicate. So what you want to do is simply put something around your controller so that way it will actually hold it for about 20 to 30 minutes for the birds to finish duplicating. So what you want to do is make sure the birds finish duplicating you will know that if your character does go on the hay bale. It can take some time, that is why I do advise getting an elastic band or something to put around your controller so that way you don't physically have to hold it for 20 to 30 minutes. When your online character goes to the hay bale, just make sure they do in fact stick, as sometimes it does tend to actually go back to the trailer by mistake. The simple fix for this is go ahead and go to recently used actors and then just go back and forth to the actual online character and the bird. When your character is on the hay bale, go ahead and delete it from the shortlist. 
So when you have your character stuck to the hay bale and actually have them deleted, go back to actors and then pick any of the categories and then press X on appearance. And as you can see, mod outfits should appear. So the mod outfits that you do actually want to get is ones with Christmas mask and make sure none of the outfits have any beast hands or Christmas clothing as they do not save. So when you actually do have a Christmas mask, on an outfit you do like and nothing else on the outfit is actually blacklisted then go ahead and actually shortlist that character. From there go ahead and enter director mode with that character. Now when you're in director mode you want to wait like a couple of seconds for it to fully like load in and then just do the story mode and go to the wheel and select any story mode character. So when you actually do select a story mode character, it will in fact go black screen and then you will be in story mode. From there, go to start online and start up an invite only session. When you're actually loading into the session, it will in fact kick you from the actual online and make you return to story mode. But do not worry, as it will actually show you for a quick second or so your actual character meaning you will be able to see if the glitch actually saved the outfit or not. When you actually do load back into story mode, simply just go back to online free invite only session. And then when you load in for the second time, you will actually have the outfit still on. And just like that, when you load in, you will in fact, like I said, have the outfit still on. Go ahead from there and actually save the outfit to any slot in your character. So yeah, that is it for today's video. If you did go on to enjoy it, be sure to drop a like and subscribe if you did. Make sure to turn on that bell icon so you never miss future videos. I do go ahead and upload. And yeah, Venom Plays, signing out. Peace.